Hello everyone and welcome back to Blueprints. This is actually Blueprints 2.0. He actually created a new mod pack and added a few mods like Mechanism, which I cannot wait to get into. Now, I started somewhere over there, came over the mountain, and I found a portal gun. Oh, whoops. Nope. There we go. So, yeah. Uh, oh, here we go. So, yeah, this is going to make everything a lot easier. It is going to... Oh, yeah, and I built a house with uh, some saplings and trees around. So, right now, I didn't really do much exploring besides coming over the mountain. So, as I talk about what I want to basically happen in this series... I am also going to do a bit of exploring and collecting some of this fabulous mossy stone for when I start Tinker's Construct because it that's one of the best mods out there. Uh, if you don't like Tinker's Construct, honestly they just make tools so much easier to use and make and they look a lot cooler with you not having to worry about RNG giving you great enchantments. That's just a, actually, is there, did he add an Ender IO? I forget. Ender IO. Wait, no, that's. Uh, no. So there's no Ender IO. Okay, I can deal with that. So, as we go exploring, let's. Uh, I don't know how to use this map. Actually. Let's go back to the house. This is off to a great start of me being so productive. So let's actually go back. Oh yeah, I got the portal gun. Forget about this. Oh, I'm gonna starve. Okay, sorry cows. Looks like you might have to give up for the cause. Um, just gonna do something. Oh yeah, waypoint. Uh, home. It's that easy. Let's make it a nice... Purple stand out? Yeah, purple's gonna stand out. Let's actually test this. Aha! Ah, oh, that is sweet. Okay. Sorry, buddy. So we got one down... Let's try to get as much food as we can. Ooh, a pumpkin. Okay. And one mod I want to get into kind of quickly is Botania. Because they actually nerfed the easy stuff. Like the Dayblooms, Nightshades, and Hydrangeas. To now they despawn. I remember in one of my worlds, I created a giant Botania Ray. Of just Daybloom, Nightshades, and Hydrangeas. It was the most absurd looking thing ever. But it generated massive... Oh, oh yeah, I need to go ahead and get cobblestone. I only have one left. It generated massive amounts of mana, which was great. Ooh. Oh yeah, Thumbcraft is in here. I didn't... I gotta dabble into that. I don't never really use Thorncraft. I mean, each time I played, I, you know, started it. But Thorncraft is just that mod I'm like, yeah, I'll get to eventually. And by the time I actually ever got to it, it's like, I'm done about everything, so it's not really worth it. I would love to get into Thorncraft. Okay, so let's actually just take a bunch of this cobblestone. Ooh. Ooh, that's a nice cave down there. It's actually... Oh, that's not really a cave. We have this. And I know it's going to look really dark, but let's just see. Yeah, no. Let me... Oh. Sorry for how dark it is. I was just seeing if that cave was actually worth exploring in the future, which it's... Nah, it just ends. So if we can get 
Man, if we could get lucky and get a cave like early on, that would be great. You have to go absurdly far and explore them. You know what? Let's just be lazy. Oh, I never... What happened to my crafting bench? I had one. Oh, yeah, that... I got blown up by a creeper and that kind of got destroyed. Yeah, that was somewhere over there. Yes, to a creeper blow up my crafting bench, I totally forgot. Oh. I didn't even grab enough cobblestone. That's it back. Haha, that worked. So let's actually... Oh, why is my pick almost dead already? Barely even used it. Uh, can that... Uh, is it control shift F3? Sorry for that, I'm just trying to figure out... Nah, I can't remember. I can't remember what the way is to look up the durability for items. I know it's something like shift F3. So let's redo that. Okay, so how much coal? I got enough. Um, let's put it right here. That's really loud. Nope, okay, let's, there we go, I could, oh, oh god. Oh yeah, I gotta make this, oh yeah, I made three doors. So I'm stupid. Okay, so let's cook that up. And while I cook that up, let me just tell you what I'm planning. So, I want to make a giant factory where I can get all of this, where I can put all of these machines for mechanism I want to make well I mean set factory I want to make like a big fortress town that's something I want to do have a building for each mod we can go over this swamp very happy you know what yeah I think I might stick with that for now maybe build like a fortress or something Because it's not like there's this big giant mod to go for. I don't think this is anything that brews then. I know this is biomes of plenty. Does it have bibblecraft? I forget. B I B. No. Dang it. If this is a bibblecraft. That would be great. I can go for my. Usually for some of the mod packs I play. Oh. My, uh. Ugh, think of me words. Oh, yeah. My standard goal. Let's turn that down really low. Yeah, okay, that's a lot better. Sorry for anyone's ears I hurt. Uh, so you in there, you in there. Let's take three of you. Hey, one of my goals when uh, my pack has bibliocraft, bibliocraft, is for me to make armor stands and make like a little armor area where I can collect all of the um <clears throat> sorry all the different types of armors from each mod pack which that's kind of the thing I generally go for actually what am I saying Botan Botan bleh, Botania has like the guy guardians which I can go for and then Actually, let me craft some torches. Where's my coal? Here it is. Britannia has the bosses and... Incorrectly, Thongcraft has, like... A dimension or something that you can go to. Something like that. Remember correctly... Say, oh well. Let's... Actually make some drying racks... So listen to that. There we go. And drying racks from Tinker's Kind. Let's make two more. 
So we have four drawing racks from Tinker's Construct. I wish they changed depending on um what color would you make it out of? The car just made out of spruce and it just comes to the standard O color. That'd be great if you can choose that. Actually, let me also... Okay, what uses does a pumpkin have? Ooh, it has adventure backpacks. That's really helpful. Okay, and this does not look like it actually has any fantastic crafting. Yeah, so I'm just going to turn this into seeds for now. Uh, let me actually, let's go exploring again. Let's see if traveling out a little distance can do anything. Let us see. And you know, starting here, depending on what happens, might make a cut and come back. So, goodbye. And we're back. So I found this little cave here, which is homes right over there. I cut a little back there. I've traveled with a total of pipe under a minute. Or I might just, yeah, no, I didn't really say much. So I might have just cut the entire thing out. So if you look here on the map, there's a huge complex of tunnels I can get to from here. So let's put down a torch. So we have, oh, so we can actually just hop up here. So let's go exploring. Ooh, we found lava, so that's a good thing. Ooh, some marble. I like building out of marble. Very useful in chisel. Actually, I'm pretty sure this has, yep, this has chisel. Uh, yeah, yeah, chisel. And the marble, yeah, the marble's some chisel. <laughs> I can read. So let's actually continue going down. Travel into here. Where does this take me? Yep, I am not scaling up there. It takes me down to here. Let me... Come on. Put that there. Nope. Nope. Yeah, I saw that coming. That was that. Okay, so let's... Okay, you're just going to be annoying and not get blocked. Yay, no more water. Okay, so that's nothing really. I mean, if I could find one of those bat backpacks. That'd be great. Okay, um I do have some cobblestone, yes. Oh wait, I don't have to say I was thinking oh I might have to I might want to save it for when I start Tinker's construct. Because you can make um moss out of it, but I'm right next to the one biome that has moss stone naturally spawn, so I don't really have to worry about that, so let's just waste all the stone we have, and let's go, let's just explore, let's not mine let's just explore the caves okay, so this brings me here that's down here, wow I like exploring caves, they're fun, I like exploring the caves, it's always fun especially when you have the happy sounds of a slime just wanting to make its presence know with its floppy noises. And if you guys cannot hear that, then just... I'm just... Just let my ramblings of a crazy person just continue. Yeah, no, just... Yeah. It's right there. So that's probably a hill there. So let's actually... Block this off. Get okay. I'm gonna run out of dirt. So let's actually come up. Yeah, so there should be. Come, why can't I get up? Okay, there. Wow, that was odd. Oh, I forgot about the biomes. Do that now. Oh, is that 1.8? Is that 1.9? That swamp biomes generate like that. Uh, I wish I had a. What is this? Uncut lettuce. I. What is that? Extra foods? Yeah, I gotta. I never really dabbled into that. So I gotta do that as. There's a lot of stuff I have to do. 
So let's just get as much dirt. Okay, that should be enough to cover up the hole. Not to worry about. I hate running water. It's so annoying. Here we go. Let's go there, 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 and there. No more water. That is fantastic. Oh, I'm here. What's this? Actually, I had no idea where I was. Well, great thing that I have the porter gun. I can oh yeah, so it's right here. Okay, so I know where I am. Yeah, so the portal gun is great because now I can, um, yeah, words come to me. All right, teleport back home. I don't need to worry about getting lost. So that's the one thing I hate is always getting lost in the, ah, oh, dang it. So let me just, uh, you guys cannot see anything, so let's put you up, and let's head home. Delicious food. Uh, do I have more on flesh? Yeah, I do. So let's put you up. And you know what, let's just call that here. Uh, thank you for watching, I've been the Gill Gamer, and this is Minecraft Blueprints Mod Pack. This time I will remember... I will remember to put a link for the mod pack in the description. So, thank you all for watching. I've been the Gill Gamer. If you enjoyed, please leave a like. It is greatly appreciated for other people to see my comment co content. And if you'd like to see more about some of the mods I've been talking about, I do have guides for Botania and Mechanism on my channel. Thank you all for watching. I'm the Gator Gamer, and have a good day, everyone. Bye.